Ahead of a memorial ceremony to mark the 66th anniversary of the U.S. atomic bombing of Nagasaki, young people have prepared water as an offering for victims who died while suffering from thirst. Elementary, junior high and senior high school students on Monday ladled water from a fountain at a memorial venue. The annual ceremony is to take place in the city's Peace Park on Tuesday. The water is to, put, is to be put on the altar for the victims and offered by their relatives and survivors. <laughs> After the water offerings on Tuesday, participants are to observe a moment of silence at 11.2 a.m., the time the bomb was dropped in 1945. Japan's Meteorological Agency has issued an interim report on the country's tsunami warning system based on information from the March disaster. The agency has been reviewing the system after finding that it resulted in a significant underestimation of the sizes of the tsunami waves immediately after the quake. The report cites the limited accuracy of tsunami alerts based on the current eight-level scale covering wave heights from 50 centimeters to over 10 meters and suggests switching to a five-level scale. It also proposes issuing alerts such as those for possible giant tsunamis immediately after the quake and the magnitudes over eight. Providing information to enable people to take action that will ensure their safety is more important than giving accurate numbers. The agency plans to present a revised tsunami warning system this year. China has begun operating a new nuclear power plant in the southern province of Guangdong, showing that the nation's policy of promoting nuclear power generation remains unchanged. The state-run Xinhua News Agency said that the number four reactor of the Lingao nuclear power plant in Shenzhen became operational on Sunday. The reactor called the CPR-1000 is a new type of pressurized water reactor with a generation capacity of 1 million kilowatts. It was based on French technology but was constructed by China. This is China's first reactor to become operational after the accident in March at the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant in Japan. China now has 14 nuclear reactors in operation with 27 more under construction.